Oh, wow. Wow. Right. Oh, wow. Damn. So, Duck girlfriend right here. Yeah, she a real one, y'all. She a fucking real one. Yeah. Now, people allegedly saying because her last name the same as um, 051 Melly that, uh, yeah, she really, yeah, could be, you know, they just making her rumors. Basically saying, yeah, she could be trying to backdoor him and all that bullshit. Bullshit, because anybody you're backdoing, you ain't shooting back at nobody. Yeah. According to Truth Teller, I guess it's room in Chicago that she was kin to one of Doug Ops just because her last name and people just talking. But even if she was, you got Blazing Dog messing with the one of the T, uh, HF members. Yeah. It'd be different. Now, sometimes that could backfire. And sometimes, you know, it can work out where everybody got a mutual understanding. Like, I can't do nothing because sis with him or bro with her, you know? And everybody know 051 Miller used to mess with uh, King Vaughn's sister too. So it's crazy. That's how it was like in Savannah though. Um, yeah, you could be messing with your ops, yeah, sister or, you know what I'm saying? Cousin and yeah, it can go either way. You know, not saying Chicago is smaller than Savannah, but if you just focus on that sector of just 63rd, 64th, old block, and yeah, it's pretty small where it's going down at. Yeah, that's like a city in itself. The violent part, the violent part. But on another note, well, back on the same note, FBG Duck Girl has something to say in her testimony. It went this way. Ha! She said, the man was in line. I guess Duck didn't bring his pistol. I'm going to leave it up there. He didn't bring his pistol, y'all. He was in line trying to buy his son some clothes. So that means he might have got killed on his son's birthday or the day before. Ain't that crazy? Yeah, so in downtown Chicago, you really expecting that to happen. So I hear. So I hear. Yeah, so he probably felt like, yeah, I'm just going there grab some real quick, baby. You sit in the car. He waiting in line. It's the pandemic time when you had to wait in line with the mask on and letting about two or three in at that time. By this time, yeah, allegedly, the boy TZ, mad because Duck was smashing his baby mama, so they say. So they say. Made the call. <laughs> Tried to call D thing phone, which is Dirk brother. They keep trying to, yeah, throw this in and putting the hype on Dirk brother. <laughs> yeah, that way. But it's all alleged. It's all alleged. Well, basically, he must have called and said, yeah, the nigga down here now. Thirsty for that money that allegedly King Vaughn offered. Yeah, if they did the job, which it was five of them, $20,000 ain't shit. If you gonna take it and split a hundred up between five folks. Yeah, not for your life to get thrown away. Not for your life to get thrown away. You know, RIP to King Vaughn. I'm not sure of it, but Mama Duck pretty much, yeah, feeling like he wanted her son that bad. And they wanted that money that bad, and they went down there in two different cars. But let me show y'all this too. Ah, because they're saying that license plate reader, yeah, read the car, but those boys lawyer, like, it, it might don't be accurate. We don't know if y'all put salt in the game and talking about this and that. You feel me? Y'all talking about y'all see the car. Y'all ain't seen nobody get out of it, but y'all just know the car go back to, yeah, buddy, Los. Yeah, and one of them, I think, the uh, C murder. Yeah, so at the end of the day, yeah, them boys still saying they ain't guilty now. They saying they ain't guilty, you know? But us knowing the feds with that 97, 98% uh, rate, yeah, we feel like they toasted. We feel like they toasted. Yeah. But let's go back to uh, FBG Duck, uh, yeah, girl. I don't know if they had a baby for her. Yeah, the one I showed y'all prior in this pic. She was in the car. She seen the members jump out. I ain't gonna say O Block, cause it's all a legend. Well, y'all think it is jumped out. With the masses gonna shoot in that duck. Ra, 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 ra. She, she grabbed duck gun. So we thought that duck had his gun on him and was shooting back in the jam. She actually had the gun. Yeah, that way. Had the gun. Yeah. But 
you know, she's probably never been in this before, but she did her best, y'all. I promise you. The girl shot through the window. Da, da, da. Start shooting back at him. Yeah. And that when they shot at her. And I believe she got hit in the, uh, her wrist or something like that. So I let you know she was shooting. <laughs> yeah, that way. Yeah. She got shot too, I believe. Yeah, that way. Excuse me, y'all. And, um, yeah. Um, she fired back. How many of y'all girls gonna fire back for your ninja? You know? She fired back. Out through the window, wherever she fired. How she fired? Yeah, she knew how to cock it back. He probably had one in the head already. She just grabbed him and ah, rah, rah, shooting, shooting at them. So now that took some steam off a duck. He might have been supposed to got hit with more than 16 bullets. But her firing back made some of them direct the shots at her. And she took some of the shots for duck. Yeah. So why y'all talking about, oh, she's the ops, uh, sister, cousin, whatever rumor y'all got out. She showed sure and performed like she was trying to back door duck. She loved him. She loved him. Yeah, because I don't know too many of y'all women going to take the gun. Yeah, and da, 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 and risk your life and put your life on the line and take a hit for your ninja. He had a real one, boy. Yeah, that way. Duck, you chose a real one. Also, Duck said some, uh, for him to be hit 16 times, the police asked him a question. Told him he might don't make it. That man said, he asked him where you were shot at. Duck said, she was all over. He had enough strength to say that, you know? And I ain't taking no sides. But just imagine you downtown with your kids shopping on a regular day where nothing didn't happen in a long time. This is where you think you got your peace of mind at. Get away from old block. Yeah, 63rd and all the bullshit. And you're going to do a good deed and go get your son. But you know, say you out there while Duck was out there. And bullets start to fly and your kids was at risk. You know what I'm saying? You got to think like that. Stop thinking street all the time. Think about the people with down there. They want to see, who, if these are the guys that did it, they want to see their ass up in there. And the feds gonna push it to the limit. Because how many people died at the door that one downtown the feds ain't pick up? I'll wait. Nobody. It's a regular state case. So these folks ain't playing. Now, you know the lawyer, they lawyers gonna have to raise some stuff like, yeah, that's not a big thing to raise about the license plate. Like, nigga, it was your car. Well, tell us who in it. And free yourself. But you can't do that because it's the streets. Yeah, so they're going to go with, oh, uh, you was in it. You know? Then Doug got people who love him. Like the baby mama or the girlfriend that was shooting back. Yeah, she in court. Crying on stand. Then took a few for him. Said she had to wait. This is right here. You know, after she seen him running off, that was she got in and checked on him. Now, if she shot and still get out and check on a man, that's a soldier. That's a soldier, you know? If I ain't mistaken, I believe she got shot, y'all. Y'all let me know in the comments if I'm wrong. Cause even if he ain't got shot and them niggas running, she don't know nobody gonna come back and go check on him. Yeah, duck, duck, yeah, that love. That love, another girl be right under the seat till the police come. Yeah, that way. But it just was unfortunately too late and duck, uh, you know, sadly passed. But what y'all think, man? How many of y'all think y'all girl that y'all sleeping with every night laying next to you is going to pick your gun up if you ain't got it on you? Somebody try to shoot at you and come out the window with that thing. <laughs> yeah, that way. Be real now. Be real. You know? That's crazy. But on another note, I be telling you about this dude, Trenches News. Yeah. If you don't know what Trenches News is, here you go right here. He keep that damn mask on. He keep that mask on, y'all. And I know why now. The man got paid. So now, um, I think the prosecutors was talking about him. Oh, matter of fact, their lawyers basically saying he gave a testimony and the feds paid him trying to portray or draw the picture up saying the feds want these boys so bad they paying anybody to just lie on them, to lie on them, you know? And if you don't know, yeah, he wouldn't even down there. But if you don't know this, it's, it's this a Rico. So all they want is the information to prove that this is a gang and this was a gang hit. And the person who died was in the gang. And get what they're going to do. Open up the avenue for most shit to get raided once this go. Yeah, that way. They're going to try to roast them boys right there. Got all this information, you know, from Trenches News, which I'm going to show you Truth Teller talking about this. Yeah, and also he's saying he don't know when butter gonna come in. 
and how butter beefing with Mama Duck for some reason that we don't know right now. He on the internet talking more reckless, y'all. Yeah, that way. They just were cool. He just had the uh, Halloween party or birthday party, something like that. Yeah. And Mama Duck is his kid's grandma. I'm talking about butter. Yeah. But we'll see how it play out. We'll see how it play out. But, uh, yeah, that girl that Duck had, yeah, she definitely was a soldier. I don't give a damn. If she was on the other side, nigga, I'd say she was a soldier. Hey, it is what it is. And for her to still come to court and stand on all 10, she is a civilian now. She ain't, uh, it ain't like she was walking around with the pistol on her. Like, yeah, I'm waiting for somebody to run up on Duck. She went and got the pistol probably seen where you put it at. You know, I'm quite sure he ain't got the car out of Chicago. He could have did that, though. Hey, baby, be on guard. Yeah, no. Nah. But in my opinion, yeah, he started getting shot at. She seen them boy jump out of her ninja, grab that thing, and was shooting through the window. Nah, you know she ain't really got the, she ain't roll the window down. She just reacted. You know what I'm saying? Y'all shooting my ninja. And grabbed it and shot with the window up. You know? So at the end of the day, um, all I can say is shouts out to that girl. Strong woman, strong woman. But here is Truth Teller talking about the other truth teller, the one who got paid by the feds. Yeah. They build a Rico up. Now his testimony ain't got nothing to do with Duck getting shot. It's about who's the high ranking members in the thing, what people got to do to become a higher, higher ranked member in the game. Which I didn't know Chicago games was that organized. Probably is though. Probably is, man, because a lot of games I be seeing, like sectors of it, they ain't got it like that. Everybody say, okay, we this, we that, we woo, woo. You know, you got somebody who did more dirt. Yeah, did more dirt, and you're like, oh, yeah, that don't, don't fuck with that nigga. That nigga got this many bodies. This many, yeah, I get that. Do probably rank you up. I guess it do. I don't know. But here's Truth Teller telling you what I just described. He's going to tell you right here, right now. Oh, wow. Trenches News is another big part of the case. Because O Block lawyers is claiming that the feds are paying people to lie on these guys, basically. You know, Trenches News wasn't part of this. Uh, he wasn't, you know, looked for. He didn't have a warrant out for his arrest or anything like that. This guy offered information. He didn't broker a deal. It ain't like his information helped him get a lighter sentence or anything like that because he wasn't investigated on this crime. They saying that basically he was paid to lie on them, basically. And that's strong, you know. Trenches News did have a relationship with O'Block. Had a relationship with FBG, too, so I don't know, you know. I can tell you that out of all the shit that I've read so far in the transcripts, all the information people have told me, Trenches News is the only person I know that so far that is going to, you know, corroborate and say that this is basically like a RICO case. Everybody else's information has just said that, you know, we seen these guys get in this car or these guys were beefing with Duck and, you know, the baby mama saying this number belonged to D thing and another baby mama saying TZ was jealous of Duck. You know, we got that information. Trenches News information tells the story of the hierarchy in the game, how the game run. You gotta pay dues uh, about how you get the guns. People getting beat up if they don't pay this amount of money. You know, Trenches News kind of gave evidence of a Rico case, racketeering. He's gonna be a star witness. Now, I'm not sure if the, they wanna still call him because he's been doing videos, a lot of shit on the internet. I don't know if him on the stand is gonna come across as very truthful. Uh, so I don't know if they are gonna call him, but they said they were gonna call him to testify and they said Trenches News stood by what he told the feds. He stood by. We didn't see him in interviews, and it looked like he's standing ten on that shit, you know. So I'm not sure exactly what come in. I'm not sure what butter come in at. I see butter and duck mom look like they beefing on the internet. So I'm not sure if these people want to call these guys up to the stands. It don't look like they testimony gonna be reliable. But pump your brakes. Make sure y'all hit that thumbs up. That's the like button. Also hit the notification bell. That way you get notifications from me every time I drop this high-ish off the press. Now here we go. Oh, uh. Well, there you have it. Truth teller breaking down trenchant news. Yeah. But this is what y'all choose to watch. Y'all rather let his algorithms go to the from Chicago. He ain't did that for Duck, he did that for pay. Yeah, and they let you know he greedy because he already getting paid off the content. 
if it ain't a lie what he's saying. I mean, he told this month, twelve this month, this and that, and you still going to tell for some money? And then you cool both sides. You was on Oblock side, FBG Duck side. So you didn't tell on the FBG Duck thing. And I'm quite sure they didn't come knock on your door. Because they didn't see your license plate down there and say, oh, he was down there. Let's go go find him. Now nah, you found him. And say, look, I can let you know the sector, what they got to do to rise up. I've been on this side and I've been on FBG Duck side. And y'all just paid me a check. Yeah. And he's a star witness, as you heard Truth Teller say. Yeah. Now, will they use him being that the other side is like, bro, this man probably lying. He got paid to lie. His, his word's not reliable, you know. Then truth, hey, not truth teller. Then Trish News got to watch his ass because the feds ain't going to like that. So you mean to tell me you come to send me some information that ain't help with the case at all? Yeah. Yeah, that way. But if his story matches a butter story, it is still going to archive for when they try to, you know, try a case against Old Block. That's what I'm trying to tell y'all. Nah, I ain't trying to put no bad blood on. Yeah. But I think they need to just kind of stop screaming uh, Old Block and all that for a minute and do interviews like BJ did on uh, Adam 22. I ain't BD. No. I ain't GD. I ain't on no game. I'm just from that area. Yeah, that way. That would need to be going on right now. Because Duck case, rather they win or lose, it's still gonna go down in the books with the information that uh, Butter gave, yeah, that Trenches New gave, and that whoever else gave that ain't even famous. Yeah, that way. So um, to O Block and FBG, y'all need to lay low. Y'all better tell some old ass story that ain't got nothing to do with nobody's. Because this is opening the eye, the fear eye, to be watching y'all now. Yeah, that way. They watching y'all. You know? And um, that was a crazy move from the dude duck like that downtown. Because, yeah, they opened the door for federal. It went past state now. Federal. But y'all let me know what y'all think in the comments. Always use y'all mind and think. Because the mind is a terrible thing. No ways. And, uh, yeah, talk to me in the comments. Become respectful. Because I curse a bitch out. And I'm going out hard the same way I came in. Oh, my baby dragon said, send some cash out so he eat good like he eat every day. Yeah, send some cash apps. What's your cash app? Dollar sign. I A M S U P A K O O L. Don't y'all want to see his beard grow? Look how he looking around. Look. Yeah, I'm talking about you. I'm trying to get you some money. Where's Turd at the new one? Look how big his turd is, though, y'all. Come on now. Come on now. Show some love for the better dragon. He's trying to get a bigger uh, tank. <laughs> wow.